नमस्कार टू ऑल द लिसनर्स फ्रॉम अराउंड द ग्लोब एंड अ बिग थैंक यू टू ऑल ऑफ यू टू ट्यून इन टू टूडेज प्रोग्राम ऑफ खेल ग्रहों का आई एम योर होस्ट मोहित श्रीमाली द टॉपिक फॉर टूडेज प्रोग्राम इज टू डाइव इन टू द वर्ल्ड ऑफ एस्ट्रोलॉजी एंड अंडरस्टैंड फ्रॉम द पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू ऑफ एन एस्ट्रोलॉजर हाउ द मंथ ऑफ जून टू थाउजेंड एंड नाइनटीन लुक्स फॉर ईच ऑफ द जोडी एक्स वॉट इज टू बी एक्सपेक्टेड where great precaution is to be practiced what days are going to be fruitful and which days in particular are the ones where you may suffer from health problems or problems relating to your work environment after a detailed study on youtube channel and programs relating to astrology i have come up with a more detailed analysis of the month where we'll be talking about the dates and time from where changes should be expected All this will be done by analyzing the natal moon's transition from first house to the 12th of the zodiac horoscope. Now be aware all the discussion is based on Indian standard time that is IST and if you are from any other part of the globe please carry please calibrate your clocks to IST for understanding the cause and effect of the month that we will be talking about during the program and make notes of the same in your time zone. Special mention on two dates this month a World Environment Day that falls on 5th of June and International Day of Yoga that falls on 21st June Without wasting any more time let's dive right into it and explore what the month of June has in store for us A very warm welcome to all Cancerians The analysis for the month of June 2019 for you is favorable and thus suggests good times ahead Overall synopsis For the month of June for Cancerians is the month will be lucky in terms of investments family composition however may take a dive this month you surely have seen better days in this aspect work related problems may surround you but rewards and recognitions are in order so let's start with natal moon's transition in the 10th house the time period is the 1st of June 2019 The same natal moon would transcend back in the 10th house for the period of 27th of June 2019, 7:45 a.m. up to 29th of June 2019, 4 p.m. Remember, praying is always helpful. When solution to your problems can't be found, leaning towards God will always give clarity and courage. The feeling is surreal today. New energy and feeling of being blessed, like you could take over the world. Lately your promotion is due. If you had been expecting one, this is the time you may receive. But remember the promotion comes with great responsibility and authority. Use it carefully. Appreciations are in order from superiors and so is recognition. If you had been planning to set up your own business, it is a good time to do so too. Thus, due to the your professional trips around the globe are also foreseen. Your little circle of most interested friends and family members are in full agreement and support of you. This is a good period for wealth accumulation and rise in name and fame. As soon as the natal moon transcends into the 11th house for the period of 2nd of June 2019 6:45 a.m. up to 4th of June 2019 11:40 a.m. the same natal moon would transcend back in the 11th house. from 29th of june 2019 4 pm onwards up to 1st of june 2019 855 pm this period signifies coming over trouble your enemies people who don't want good to happen for you and to petty issues in your personal life is also foreseen overall this period foretells increase in income accumulation of profits good company gathering of friends and family replenishing on the lost energy and collection of loan amount that you must have loan to people is also foreseen always remember the credit to your success always goes to people around you and to you in last any individual is evaluated by the company he keeps thus the interest that he seeks and the way that he treats the less fortunate always remember to appreciate the woman in your life try giving this a thought Natal moon's transition in the 12th house for the period of 4th of June 2019 11:40 a.m. up to 6th of June 2019 2:50 p.m. onward. 
It is always necessary to keep a tab on your expenses. People have come to a habit of spending to show other people as to what their economical standpoint is. Rather, a good thing is to spend and save. Always remember, keeping a tab on your expenses is one of the most important things that a person has to do in financial retrospect. Try to spend moderately. This doesn't mean you shouldn't enjoy a cozy spa weekend or a shopping spree, but remember to do so responsibly with your budget in mind, as this period suggests loss in income and investment. The natal moon in the 12th house brings forth headache, fluctuations in finance, trouble in domestic life, scuffles. Therefore, increase in stress due to aforesaid situations is therefore foretold. Try to be in your lane. Don't try any unethical move in business or in your workplace. You may have to pay for it dearly. Natal Moon's transition in the first house for Cancerians may sing the songs of praises and appreciation. The time period we are speaking of is from 6th of June 2019, 2.50 pm onwards, up to 8th of June 2019, 5.25 pm. Travels, praises, good health, good times. This day may be marked for happy times with family and friends. A reward if you say for the all the hard work you have put in the previous days. For my friends in corporate sectors, target meetings, performance reviews and general meetings may as well go with breeze. You are going to be appreciated for your work. In addition, this is also a good day to plan your investments and move forward. For those trying to light up that old spark, this is the day. A short drive and quality time is sure to set you up in the right mood. For all people seeking to close deals this day may as well be the most suitable time period. But remember to set boundaries in your professional lives, as too much work may start eating up in your domestic life. Natal Moon's transition in the second house for the period of 8th of June 2019, 5.25 pm onwards, up to 10th of June 2019, 8 pm. For all good things come to an end, so does the good days. Be ready for a short day of leg pulling. Humiliation, non-cooperation from peers and a few keen eyes wouldn't have taken appreciation and recognition of yours so well. But always remember it's a phase. Within no time this will pass. Today what seems impossible, tomorrow it will be attainable. Worries will surround you. However, regarding future course of action, it is better to refrain yourself from arguments, fights and try leaving work in the office. Dragging the same to home may result in disturbance in your domestic life. Try having a good sleep. The next transition of natal moon will surprise you and set you up for the lost times ahead. From 10th of June 2019, 8pm onwards, up to 12th of June 2019, 11.25pm, the natal moon would transcend into the third house. So, what does it mean? This particular period would be all about success, achievement, happiness, positivity and great energy. A sound sleep relaxes you to take on the day with stride. For all nagging and leg pulling, this is your day to show why you are the best. With great confidence and head held high, you could close deals, achieve targets. This day will be full of energy and siblings, friends, relatives will show full support. Domestic disturbances, however, will fade. Your attempts towards your goal will seem sure-footed and attainable. Try giving your partner a little relief. Cook. Go out. Dine. Your happiness and energy needs to be shared with people around you. For all people, Natal Moon in the 4th house. From time period 12th June 2019, 11.25pm onwards up to 15th of June 2019, 4am. The Natal Moon in the 4th house hinders progress. First of all, Drive safe. Follow road rules. Keep your eyes peeled on the road. A small mistake can cause a domino effect. That means damage to the vehicle, self-injury and injury to others on road. I don't need to explain this point in more detail as I believe all you watching this episode get the seriousness of the issue. This time period could cause anxiety, panic, restlessness, surge in blood pressure and stress levels. Relatives from maternal side can cause troubles or disturbance in your household. Take special care of your health, especially chest and digestive tracts. Play cautiously with money and restrain yourself from pulling out or making investments today.
natal moon in the 5th house for the time period of 15th of june 2019 for am onwards up to 17th of june 2019 10:45 am this particular time period can cause digestive tract problems i told you in the period of 4th house that may be something as small as upset stomach or something serious take special care before it gets to a stage where treatment is unavoidable you will feel demotivated and unappreciated constant turbulence in your work life is also foreseen remember try putting your best foot forward and not get agitated by constant questioning this particular time period it is better to take a step back in the period and reevaluate the scenario and your plan of action natal moon in the 6th house for the time period of 17th of june 2019 10:45 am up to 19th of june 2019 8 pm the investment done in prior to this period check on them timely this is a right time to invest and reap what you have sowed health wise your trajectory has shown major flux from past few days and thus a recovery period is ahead and special care is to be taken however the natal moon in the 6th house from the native's house exhibits progress and good health financial gains jovial moments and many more however caution must be taken when getting involved with the opposite sex as for any troubles overall a good time to enjoy the company of your partner financial gain health recovery and success at this day is foreseen natal moon in the 7th house gives unhindered progress and uninterrupted happiness positivity all around expansion of social circles especially in the opposite gender is foreseen if you have been planning to purchase a movable or immovable asset this may be the time to move ahead on this plan and make favorable dealings this period also is for long term investments and wealth creation for people planning to restructure the investment portfolios this may as well be the time to do so natal moon in the 8th house for the time period of 22nd june 2019 8 am onwards up to 24th of june 2019 8:20 pm the weekend doesn't seem to be any good this time of the month health problems stress anxiety aggression pointless disputes depression and disagreement are ahead especially accidents due to careless driving may cloud you this weekend try to stay sober hydrated eat healthy and drive cautiously if any conference is scheduled for the weekend that is a teleconference a video conference any urgent meeting in the office try to stay calm and composed the mantra for this particular weekend is to forgive and forget easily natal moon in the 9th house 24th june 2019 820 pm up to 27th of june 2019 745 am to all the cancerians it would seem like the dark clouds won't leave your side constant self doubt and body pain specifically in hips thigh low region is foreseen disputes in the family composition as mother and daughter father and son or vice versa is also foreseen learn to disagree to agree many a times in a heated conversation people blurt out things that they don't mean and later feel sorry a good solution to your problem is to let the dust settle and then put up your point be careful of office politics in this period giving a small amount of time to god will bring peace and prosperity it calms you down and reenergizes you with new hope and clear vision if you are part of any ngo or planning to join one there is a possibility you may also get involved in some charity work this weekend